One of the reasons we're able to bring this video to you, these old specials from KEZI, is because KEZI, the Chambers family, before they sold the station to a national company, gave the archives to the University of Oregon Special Collections. And that's why we're able to bring all this to you. But the Special Collections is more than the KEZI collection. They have all sorts of information in there. So we're talking with Elizabeth Peterson from the Special Collections and the Archives Department um, just to kind of give you an idea of what it is they do. They want you to use this stuff. We're here at the University of Oregon Archives to talk to Elizabeth Peterson. Do you think that sometimes as, as the public, um, we see the University of Oregon Library and the archives and the special collections is something that is distant and you really don't want that. Oh, you no. You want us in here. You want us using, this is yeah, a living history. Different. This isn't supposed to be, I, I think the word archive sometimes makes us think stand back and stay or, right, back. Or that it's dead or that it's behind a glass case like a museum. Um, and certainly these things are often beautiful objects, but no, these are meant to be used. I mean, these foam cradles that you see around here, those are intended to gently allow you to open a book because we want you to use those medieval manuscripts. We want you to look at that Oregon Trail diary. Um, we, we absolutely want people to come in here. And, and how, how we can get the word out about that um, in, in specific ways, I think is challenging because they're so vast and diverse to say, we have all kinds of stuff. It doesn't really tell people much. And libraries are all about that, is serving our user community. And Special Collections is not just the university community, but it's, it's the city of Eugene, it's the state of Oregon, it's the Northwest region. And in often case, it's, it's an international community that we're serving. A lot of, we have a lot of researchers that come from overseas to use the materials here.